It's Friday. It's Friday. It's Friday. Yeah, we were just it's saying Friday. on Friday. We love Friday. We do. And Everybody you... loves Friday. Yeah, yeah, because weekend's Friday. coming. Do you have any plans? Uh, I'm going to sleep in. That's I'm going to sleep in past 3 a.m. How about only, that? That's, that's a good plan, right? the only plan, right? plan I have, pretty much. And it's I'm going to eat, and I'll do some other stuff. It depends on the weather. You know, it yeah. rains here a lot in Florida, but um, I want to go to the zoo, yeah. and I'm going to go horseback riding. Oh, I, sound like my, I sound like my well, daughter. <laughs> because, well, you know, you do sound like a little kid. I know. Um, and so bear with Fun. me, because my voice is not good today. I'm just getting over this lousy cold. This is the last part of the cold, is now I can't talk. Because I'm on it. So that's all right. I got you, just in case I can't talk to back to you. <laughs> Anyway, this is a sign. I'll be like, guy wants to tell you <laughs> yes. that it's Customer Appreciation Month. Exactly right, because right? it's April, and we love yeah. April for that because we do lots of great things, uh, including take care of our customers who we love so much. Um, so what we've been doing is we've been giving away a thousand dollars every day to charities that are nominated by our customer, and today's charity is Shannon, it or was, was chosen was by chosen by Diane Frederigo, who nominated Mikey's Way Foundation. It was founded by Michael Friedman, a teenage cancer patient who wanted to help others, and sadly he lost his battle to cancer but his dad, Les, has continued the charity. That's really special. So. Yeah. Diane told us, when my seven-year-old grandson Cameron was diagnosed with leukemia, Les Friedman with Mikey's Way Foundation visited the hospital and gave the children gifts. He was an angel, and I vowed to do something to help his charity. Yeah, and now since Mikey's Way began in 2005, they've reached over 6,000 seriously ill children with gifts of electronic devices Aww. to connect them with their family and friends during the treatment. We want to um, say our thanks to Diane. Mikey's Way Foundation, or excuse me, thanks to Diane, Mikey's Way Foundation is going to be receiving $1,000 dollars from HSN cares a thousand bucks a thousand bucks yeah. that'll go a long way and, and yeah. purchase a lot of electronic items for those kids that really will make a huge difference in their lives so thank you for being a part of our customer appreciation we appreciate you and all of the charities that you're involved in you can always see more by searching HSN cares on hsn.com mm -hmm. all right it is Friday and we have a fantastic today's special today oh to my get gosh. your outdoors looking looking like you hired one of those amazing electricians right. um, but no electrician necessary okay. Stab it in the ground and walk away. I can That's do all that. you gotta do. You know what I do? I let I let this I let the Lord power it up because the sunshine comes <laughs> and it powers right. up your lights. You don't have to plug Amen anything to in. It's such a great deal. And literally, um, we're gonna take care of all your outdoor lighting needs because not only are we giving you an incredible um, uh, pack of or a pack of outdoor pathway lights, right. but we're gonna give you spotlights too. So you can light up the ground area, you know, all your ground cover and all that around yeah. your house. And then you can also uh, highlight a special feature. I mean, hey. If you got a nice mailbox, go ahead sure, the mailbox. Sure, or a tree, a tree. or something like that. Yeah. Maybe, your, maybe your front porch. Yep. But these aren't just white lights that are solar. No. They actually turn colors. Look at that. I like that with without. You know, we do a lot of before and after pictures yeah. of, you know, skin care and things like this is what you looked like before. If your house was looking a little sad and dull, you know, just some solar lights really will make a huge difference. That where you can see, you see the up lights on the columns. Those are those spotlights. And of course, the spotlights are solar as well. So there are no ugly cords to mess with, no having to run an electrical cord out or trying to wire underneath. And of course, those are weatherproof. So you don't have to worry about if it rains or snows, they will stay beautiful and they're actually made of metal as well. All right, well, Guy has got, um, smells incredible in here. I'm smelling herbs. I can smell some, some basil, some sage. What you got? Oh, well, first thing I'm trying to do is tie my apron, <laughs> which I can't get. All right, I'm gonna get it. Hold on, I'll get there. Uh, I'm trying to do it backwards. <laughs> Kelly Diedring is here, tying my apron for me. <laughs> Hi, Kelly. Not weird, is it? No, it's okay. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. <laughs> I'll just stay out here. See, well, there's a lot of things that, you know, it's really hard to do, right? Like tying your apron yourself. Another thing that's really hard to do is chopping <laughs> okay. herbs. That's, <laughs> a, that's the best segue I can come up with. But but I'm telling you, listen, I, I you know me. I've been in the kitchen and yep. restaurant business for a long, long yep. time. So I know how to handle a knife pretty well. Um, but even when it comes to things like like small items, like radishes and stuff like that, it's yep. very difficult to use a knife. Herbs are even harder because yes. you want the herbs and, and things to get chopped up really fine because the finer that you chop them, the more they release um, you know, their great flavor. Yep. So things like basil and, and you've got sage here and you've got rosemary. You yes. don't want to do that with a knife. You want to do it with the, the Orbit, Orbit Rolling Chopper. This will literally save you so much time in the kitchen. I have to tell you, look at the triple blade system, by the way. Yeah. Very sharp blades. It comes with a cover, which is really fantastic. So you can pop that cover on and then it also folds in on itself. So it fits 
fits inside any utensil drawer, right? And then when you want to use it, you open it right back up, pop that cover off, and then you can use it two-handed or single-handed. So look at all I do is I take oh my, my herbs, I set them on my cutting board, and it's cutting tri in triple time. Look at how easy and simple it was for me to chop that parsley. But this could also be spinach, or you could even mince onions with this. Yeah. Very sharp blades, and because you have that triple action, it's going to take you seconds rather than minutes. So I want right. I want a guy to well, here, have, and he's good with a knife yeah, too, remember. I'm pretty good with a knife, but you see the problem is I would have to take this and then I have to kind of turn it yep. on its side and you have to kind of go over and over and over it. And every time, remember you only have a single blade here, yep. so you're just chopping one at a time. And, uh, you know, you also have the, the fear of chopping little your, tips of your fingers off. This, this one keeps your hand away from the blade. Now, watch how I'm using it. I can actually use it with both hands if you'd like to have double-handed control. Like you can do that. Or you can take your dominant hand and use it with a single hand. It's appropriate to use it both ways. But you can see in a matter of seconds, I have completely chopped my parsley. But whether it's parsley or your rosemary or mincing your mm -hmm. fine onions or spinach, when this you want to do awesome. spinach, you're going to have the ease of use to be able to chop it three times as fast and it's safer because you're not having to use that blade and you're not getting that blade near your finger well, yeah and you can actually sort of see what you're doing as you go and you can see that's uh, that's actually perfectly done because you've got three individual blades here. So a lot of people are saying, is it hard to clean? So that's a really good question. There's this little button right here at the top and all you do is press on that button and it comes completely out. Okay. So you wanna rinse the blades underneath the water. You could even dishwash the top part of it if you'd like to sure. and give that a rinse underwater. And then all, it do, all you do when you're finished is snap it back into place and you're ready to use it again. So it's very simple to clean while it looks difficult to clean clean everything locks into place also storage if you're just joining us there's a button on the side here let me put the lid on it so you have that cover which keeps everything away and then when you hit that button it folds flat so this will fit in your knife drawer your utensil drawer it doesn't oh, yeah. take up extra space right it's a really clever design it's actually designed by urban trend these are the, the folks that bring us that really cool salad chopper the yeah, salad slicer that sold that. out instantly great for rosemary oh you're gonna do it go yeah. for it because rosemary to me is a nightmare. It is an actual nightmare to cut rosemary, right? Because it's difficult and it's woody. And you're never gonna be able to do that with a knife unless you have oh, really is, impeccable is, knife skills. This is really ridiculous. But look good, at how that. easy it is. Now watch how Guy is using it with double hands. Now take your dominant hand, Guy, and put it right in the middle. Nope, right in the middle, grab it like that. Like yes, oh, so yeah. you can use it both well, ways. Look at how, look at that. Isn't that great? Now I want you to see this. Look at the rosemary so, that he's diced. This was kind of like the before, and look at the after there, and you can see how nicely, how great it is. And, yeah, and this what's might have been 10 seconds. Uh, yeah, literally. And then, you know, if you look at the actual, um, the blades themselves, nothing sticks to them, so they stay nice yeah. and clean. You can just rinse it off if you want to. This is one of those tools I would never put in the dishwasher. You can, you but can I never do because it rinses off. It rinses it's right like, off. Why bother? And I love that it comes with that cap included, right? And then all you have to do is pull that off and get moving. Mm. We know that a lot of of you have like urban gardens and you're doing your own fresh basil, fresh oregano, fresh rosemary, yeah. you can take it right off the vine, especially if you're doing that organic situation. Look at how beautiful that is and how easy that is. Now, let's talk about what fresh herbs do for a dish. I know a lot of folks out there that don't buy herbs because mm -hmm. they go bad very quickly and you're not right. using them in your dishes, partly because they're difficult to prepare, right? They just yeah. take a lot longer. Mm -hmm. Most of us don't want to be chopping them up. But when you add fresh herbs to a dish, it literally goes from bland to dynamite to a dish that yeah. really tastes like it's been cooked at a five-star restaurant. But you have to know how to chop it You've because... You've got to be able to <laughs> chop it finely. Nobody wants to eat a, you know, a whole stick of rosemary, do they? No, That's dude. the worst. That, you you know, I, when I was a kid, I wouldn't eat... Uh, my mother would make the rosemary new potatoes, and I wouldn't eat them because I hated rosemary that much. And now, was it not... It probably wasn't no. even chopped fine. It wasn't uh, chopped fine you, enough. You get a big chunk of that stuff, and it's yep. like, okay, why don't I just go take a bite out of a pine tree because that's kind of what it tastes like. <laughs> but... Um, but if you if you do it right and you chop it really fine like we're doing, yes, it adds just to, it imparts just the right amount of flavor. Uh, and you can do anything, chives. You know, if you want to add that Spinach. to mashed potatoes or, or stuff like that. You could um, take kale and you want to chop kale really yeah. fine for a beautiful this, kale salad. This, this, the smell in this studio right now I is know. amazing because this thing is releasing so much Look of the, the oil sage. of this product. 
Yeah, and sage is another one that, you know, normally you'd, you'd got to roll it up, you'd try to julienne it, you're not going to get Look it really, really fine. how fine you can get it. Yeah, and most most average people don't have those kind of knife skills to chop uh, anything this fine, you know, so this is great for the uh, beginner, intermediate, yep. um, or anybody that just, uh, you know, has, has a job to do and it makes it a little more, uh, it's a little challenging to do. Also, the big thing that I think here too is if you are a senior out there and you have any kind of issues with your hands. Yeah, any dexterity um, issues, yeah, strength arthritis issues. arthritis or whatever yep. it is. And, and you're looking for an easier way to chop, you know, this I have to grab with my hand and I have to push. That's a lot of work for your hand. And you have to push this, it with your other hand. You don't like want to slice your thumb. I'm driving a school bus. You're driving a bus, you're driving, driving a, a car. Driving a school bus of freshly chopped herbs. <laughs> Uh, what? Yeah, look at how easy that. Is. And I like that you can use two hands. Yeah, you can use. Because my mom has a hand, one hand, one of her hands shakes, shakes a little bit. Right. So, so this is easy. So you have complete like, control, even if it's like for teenagers. Not, 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 not. <laughs> I'm just driving the school bus. And, even uh, if it's for teenagers that are starting to cook and learning yeah. to cook, there's nothing better than teaching them the importance of using fresh herbs and chopping things easily. It. You don't have to worry about their fingers getting sliced or yeah. cut. And all you do, push everything back into place if you want like that really fine chop. But sure. you have complete control, right? So I could stop there or I could go even finer. That's, That's totally nice up to right. you. And you, you can use two hands or one. I like your little using the hand thing. Okay, here's what I'll tell you. There's only about 1,400 left. We put it on sale price. It's only $9.95. So uh, this is one of those things that you may not use it every day, but when you have it and you pull it out, people you are, are like, yep. that's cool. You have a real herb chopper. Yeah, it really does save you time. And do it that way. So yeah. if you'd like it, like I said, less than ten dollars today. It's five nine six one zero two. Um, don't go away because coming up a little bit later, my lovely friend here has um, has our incredible um, air fryer. Air fryer. Yeah. I love that air fryer. It's it's Perfect a great footprint, small in size. Because most of them are so dang big. Great it's like great okay, price. It's like a microwave oven. I'm yes. not gonna pull that thing out every yes. time I want to make some fries. This one is compact. It's perfect for two people. You can make more, more stuff for more people, but I like the size of that. That's coming up from Dash a little bit later. Yep. $9.95, last call, if you'd like the Urban Trend Orbit uh, chopper. Um, and again, one of those little extra things that just makes a big difference. If you want, <laughs> could you get this for free if you got an HSN card, Kyle? Is that how that works? Because it's $9.95, <laughs> so would it be free? Yes. I like free. Anyway. No, you want to get a penny. You'd have a penny left over. Yeah, you still have money for, for <laughs> half a piece of candy. Um, <laughs> Anyway, it's $10 off uh, if you get the card today and you can use it on anything, including the really cool item that Shannon has coming up next. Well, we are so excited to be able to bring you American Dreams, and Amer HSN American Dreams is our ongoing search for America's next great talent, our next great entrepreneur. We scour the globe to find up-and-coming uh, Inventors, latest products, very unique products like Fresh Paper. We have it here, and this is um, a little information about Fresh Paper. I never thought that these crazy experiments in my garage would lead to something. I'd learned that the world's farmers were harvesting enough food to feed the planet, but we just weren't able to distribute food efficiently enough. It all actually started when I was in middle school and I was visiting my grandma in India. My mom warned me to be really careful about drinking the tap water. I accidentally drank almost an entire cup. But my grandma made this mixture of different spices and gave me like this murky brown spiced tea and I ended up not getting sick. One day I was grocery shopping with my mom and I noticed that all the strawberries seemed to have some fuzz growing at the bottom. That was when I had that first aha moment. We started with no funding. We had no experience and we had no resources, but at every step of the way, people came forward to help us because they believed in our mission. They believed in, in the idea that simple can be powerful. That was when we first started to think that maybe we could build a social enterprise where we could sell fresh paper to growers and farmers and retailers and consumers, and that would enable us to give it away to food banks. So much of, of making a difference is just understanding that, you know, usually you are enough. You have everything that you need to take the first step.
our American Dream stories, and we want you to be able to keep all of your produce fresher longer, in fact, a lot longer, independently laboratory tested to prove that this will keep your produce fresher longer. Today, what you're getting is 24 sheets. You get three sets of eight sheets each of fresh paper, and what that means is you stick literally one paper in a drawer, you've got two years worth of fresh produce. This is gonna save you so much money. We're saving you a lot of money today. In fact, you're getting $19.95. That's less than a dollar a month to keep your produce fresh. $6.65 for you to try it out. And remember, independently tested, but also tested by our customers. Over 2 million fresh paper sold since it launched. And we have Time Magazine's one of the <laughs> top five most innovative women in food, Kavita. <laughs> I'm so glad to have Hi, you good here, Good morning. Kavita. I'm good so morning. thrilled to be here. Yeah. And, and we love hearing your story on the American Dreams about you know you and and coming up with this how amazing it is and it does blow your mind so I love that you're gonna show us how simple it is to use. Yeah so fresh paper really is the easiest way to keep your food fresh for longer it's this tiny incredibly powerful little sheet so it's not a bag it's not a new container it's actually a little sheet that's made with active botanicals that can keep your food fresh for longer naturally so you can see here all the different ways that you can use these powerful little sheets and one of my favorite favorite examples is a fruit bowl. So you can see here we have oranges, bananas, grapes, apples. This one little sheet is actually keeping everything in this fruit bowl fresh for longer. And that's because fresh paper is made with these active botanicals, organic botanicals that are actually aromatic. So you're just putting this one sheet in and that's keeping everything in the fruit bowl fresh for longer. And what's also incredible is that each fresh paper sheet actually lasts for a month. So you can leave the sheet in your fruit bowl for a month and just swap out the produce and that's it. Or when you come home from the grocery store, you can just pop the sheets into whatever containers you've already brought your produce home from the store. And so like this huge tub of lettuce, which is so hard to eat through, yes. you just pop one sheet and that's enough for everything in here. It's keeping all this lettuce fresh for longer. And that means that you're gonna save so much more money yeah. and you'll actually eat it of course you go to eat that wilted lettuce you're not eating it of course now the the aromatics from the paper don't transfer into the fruit they don't transfer into the lettuce you when you yeah. come out like when I came out on the set I was like oh it smells like um, almost like tea you know how like that delicate yeah, green tea it's that delicious maple scent and right. that's actually ah. naturally occurring from the active botanicals in fresh paper it's very delicate yeah so that delicious maple scent mm. that's naturally occurring that's how you know the paper is active and you can actually take the sheets pop them into any container but remember because each sheet lasts for a month you can actually use it in a lot of different ways so you could cut a fourth of a sheet down and that's actually enough for everything in this container or for wow. all these strawberries you only need half a sheet and what you'll keep noticing is in all of these containers we have airflow so because fresh paper is made with those active botanicals you want to make sure to have airflow but that's all you have to do so you can pop the sheet in the bottom of the fruit bowl you can actually put it under tomatoes, as long as you've got airflow, you can just pop the sheets in wherever you're storing your food and they will keep your food fresh for much longer. I love it. And you're I can't wait to go to the fridge too. This is yeah. because this is where most of us are gonna use yeah, it, exactly. is in that crisper drawer. Um, sometimes the crisper, I'm like, well, it's not keeping anything crisp. It will when you've got your fresh paper. Now it's made with paper and organic spices. Of course, it's food safe. It's designed to be put right next to your food, biodegradable, compostable. It enables households to be environmentally friendly you can use it with the containers that you already have. In fact, this sounds pretty uh, innovative, and it is, and it won the index design. That's the world's largest prize in design, like uh, the kind awarded to Apple and Tesla for fresh paper. That's pretty incredible. <laughs> that was pretty unbelievable. But you know, it's been incredible to see all the reviews. And one of my favorite examples that everyone talks about is how they'd like to drop fresh paper right into their crisper drawers in their fridge. And this is incredible because you can really see the power of fresh paper. So this one little sheet that's infused with the active botanicals is actually enough for everything in this fridge drawer. So you can just pop the sheet in, you can swap out the produce and that's it. You know, a lot of people call it like a dryer sheet for your fridge drawer and I think that's <laughs> such a great way to think about it because all you're really doing is popping the sheets in when you come home from the grocery store and it also saves you so much time and money because you're not wasting food but also you don't have to go to the store as often and I think what's most exciting for me is I just come home from the store 
and pop the sheets into whatever containers I've brought home from the store. And that's it, that keeps everything fresh for longer. And remember, you can also cut the sheets down so they really go a long way. So what you're getting today is 24 sheets. What you see here is the three different packages. Each one has eight sheets in it. So eight times three, 24. Of course, you can cut them to size. You can also use each one lasts one month. So you're getting 24 months. That's two years of fresh produce. $6.65 on your on your any major credit card. Um, and one of the things that's so great about this is I would suggest when you get it home, maybe start it at the beginning of the month. Like, always know that on you know May 1st you put in a new fresh paper because then on the first of the month you're just going to add a new fresh paper they will last in the package sealed for two over years over two years yeah, exactly and incredible. they're resealable so you can gift them they make incredible mm -hmm. gifts I know they're really popular but remember the most important thing about fresh paper is one powerful little sheet actually goes a really long way because it doesn't need to wrap things individually. It doesn't even need to be touching every single piece of fruit. So these apples, the bananas, the grapes, oranges, they're all staying fresh with this one sheet at the bottom. A lot of people call it like their kitchen secret because you just pop it in the bowl and then you can forget about it. For a whole month, you can change out the produce. So you can just think about how expensive everything in this bowl is and then imagine that you can keep switching out the produce for a whole month. It's the same thing with something like tomatoes. You just put them right on top of the sheet or with berries because oh gosh, the containers berries. have holes at the bottom you have that airflow you can just pop them right on top of the sheets and remember when you come home from the store you can also just pop the sheets into the packaging because they're made with the active botanicals you can have it touching your food there isn't any plastic mm. there are no harmful chemicals they're little paper sheets that are made with active organic ingredients that keep food fresh for a lot longer yeah. in a way that's really different from anything that we've ever seen. So innovative. They're made with paper and organic spices that have been independently lab tested, proven to keep your food fresher longer. They're food safe. Of course, you can have them touch your food, biodegradable and compostable. It enables your household to be environmentally friendly and you can use it with the containers you already have, which means you're not coming home and then taking the extra time to transfer your fruits and vegetables into other boxes or bins yeah. Anything. All and you do is just add the paper and you're good to go. One paper, one sheet for an entire drawer, that crisper drawer that you go and you dread. You're like, oh no, the carrots are going to be, you know, wobbly. The celery is not going to stand up straight. This is your solution to fresher produce. We also have that we have um, yes. to keep your cheese fresher. We have fresh paper for cheese. We also have fresh paper for bread. No more stale bread. No more hard bagels. <laughs> That's I mean, this so is exciting. The, we the love seeing the reviews solution. on those, which Look has been this. amazing. Yeah, they're all on sale and everything in fresh paper today is available on auto ship. So if you want to be able to keep these on a regular rotation, maybe you um, maybe you love to have some in your drawers yep. in your refrigerator and then or some cut them like down for your herbs. Some. Exactly. Exactly. You might want to put they, these on And they really ship. go along way when you're cutting them down too so think about each sheet lasts for a month if you're popping one fourth of a sheet into a container like this like when you have a recipe there's no way you can use all the herbs so this way you just pop the sheet in and you can continue to use them for a much longer time or what I love to do is cut half a sheet into my berries a quarter of a sheet into herbs and then just pop the whole sheets in everywhere else and because it's this really simple completely natural safe idea um, that actually started as my middle school science product. <laughs> it was based on a home remedy that my grandmother in India taught me about. It's something that can be very oh, safe in and out of your fridge. It's not made with harmful chemicals. There aren't any plastics. My grandma really taught me about this idea of going back to basics. And it really made me realize that, you know, we don't always have to use harmful chemicals and plastics to keep our food fresh. There are other really natural solutions. And my grandmother taught me about the incredible properties of these active botanicals and herbs. And that's what we've applied in fresh paper. So these powerful little sheets that you just put in your fridge drawer, in a fruit bowl, in any container to keep all your food fresh for much longer. Now, Kavita, do we use these? Um, I mean, I know the answer right <laughs> is this is one of the questions that sometimes people will ask is, can we use these inside the refrigerator and outside the yeah, refrigerator? Yeah, you can pop one in your fruit bowl, change out all the produce of this so one sheet. on your counter. Yeah, and this sheet is enough for everything in the fruit bowl. And it will so still it doesn't last to, a month. It lasts a month, okay. so you're just changing out. You can put more apples, more bananas, more oranges with something like berries. You can just put the sheets underneath and then 
then you could use them again with a different type of container. As long as you've got that airflow, you're good. And even I with the that. bread and the cheese papers, you can cut them down. Or if you're food prepping, that's my favorite use. I prepare my lunch or I make a recipe for a smoothie. Just drop the sheets in with your <gasps> pre-prepped foods. Well, you put the paper yeah, in there. Yeah, you can just sure put you it in the there store. before you make exactly. your smoothie. But, um. <laughs> and then you've got your meal prep. You can actually huh. plan your lunches. You can do a lot more planning because you don't have to waste as much time going to the grocery store. Honestly, who has time to go to the grocery store every week just to be able to eat yeah. fresh, healthy food? And that's really the goal with fresh paper is to make it easy, but also to use something that's safe and natural. Mm. We love it. You know, you're spending a lot of money on yeah. fruits and vegetables, and it's coming up to, like, peaches season yeah. and berry season, <laughs> exactly. and we want to be able to eat all of those delicious fruits. The vegetables, you know, we eat because we have to. Of course, we love some of them, too. But sometimes they'll stay in your fridge for a lot longer than you had intended. Now yep. they can, and you're not going to waste all the money. I hate it when I throw that money in the trash. I got old Brussels sprouts or old lettuce or old carrots yeah. or, or moldy strawberries because they were in there for one day and, and they got moldy. And that's the favorite moldy. thing for me oh. to hear is when people write in and say, you know, this saved me so much that I actually mm. eat a lot more fresh food now and I'm able to buy those big values because you can actually yes. use everything in this container I love that. without having so to throw simple. things away. Yeah. It's so simple to use. Obviously, the complicated technology is right in the paper. Yeah. <laughs> but today you're getting 24 for $19.95. Each paper that you're getting will last you a month. So for less than a dollar a month, you are getting fresh produce. We also want you to add in the fresh paper for your breads and fresh paper for your cheese as well. Put that on auto ship. You will yep. love eating all those beautiful fresh fruits. Thank you so much, Kavita. Thank you, Shannon. Such we'll a pleasure. Right, we'll be right back. This is the first generation that they say to women, what do you want to be? I have to do what I want to do. If I don't do it now, I will never do it. Women acquire enormous freedom with age. The greatest freedom is to say, this is who I am. I don't want to hide my age. But if they say, you look elegant, you look sophisticated, that's a compliment. Join Isabella Rossellini for the exclusive launch of Lancome's Renergy Multiglow. Starts tomorrow, only on HSN. So a lot of you have been hearing about this, the trend the last year or two, maybe three years about this air frying and what's it all about. Air fryers are fantastic. Essentially, you know, when you fry food, uh, the traditional way, deep fat fry, you take food and you completely surround it in oil so it gets crispy on all four sides. But what we've done is we've replaced the oil with air. It circulates around the food and now you get the crispiest food ever and you get it inside what we call an air fryer. This comes to us from our friends at Dash. Of course, Kelly is back with me. Hi. And let me tell you this, a lot of people were not going to buy an air fryer because initially they were like $299. Yeah. They, yeah. Very expensive and good machines, don't get me wrong, and we have some machines like that, but what, what Dash did is they said, you know what, maybe we can do this for a better price. And for a smaller if footprint. We, if we compact it down yep. a little bit so that it's just this little cylinder, and I will tell you, and it's if, you so live, cute. if you live by yourself or with another person, this is perfect, but even if you just want to do stuff for the kids and you just want to put you know, a couple of cups of, of fries or yep. cheese sticks or whatever, it's amazing. So already 100 people picked it up, even just from us uh, talking about it earlier. It's $49.95 today. It was $69. Kelly's going to show you so many different things, but I love the fact that without, with little or no oil, no we get oil. the same sort of mouthfeel, crispy, yes. crunchy. That same and, texture. Yeah, and if you buy crunch. frozen food in bags, stick it in here. Oh my gosh. Don't eat up your whole oven to make a tray of or, french fries. Or get out your deep fryer. Don't right? You don't have to get out the deep fryer any longer. You don't have to worry about all the oil ingesting it and the taste and the flavors and the guilt you feel after eating oil fried mm. food. You're still getting fried food. Don't get us wrong. It's fried with air. And the last time I checked, air had zero calories. Mm. It's this superheated, supercharged air on the inside of this gorgeous machine. Dash has really found a way to sophisticate this machine so that everybody will keep it out on their countertop and I gotta be honest for the last few months I keep putting mine underneath the cabinet and I get it out every single day that I finally removed my tea maker and replaced my tea That's maker for you because I know how much you love tea I love my tea yeah. but my air fryer I love it more so I replaced this on my countertop my tea mm. maker now lives underneath but you can see the compact design right so it's perfect for one two three maybe uh, maybe three people uh, four people if you're doing sides inside there you can see I've got about ten um, 
um, cheese, sticks. Uh, cheese sticks, mozzarella sticks. All you do is <coughs> place the bucket in the inside and then you can choose time and temperature, which is really nice. So I can actually go all the way up to 30 minutes. You probably won't need much longer for right. too many items. Air frying is very quick. And then on the top, you can go all the way from 170 to 400 degrees. Now, Plenty. if you're me, you always go to that 400 degrees yeah. because I like crispy and I like fast. You'd and I pretty... really haven't found anything that I've burnt in it. No, and, and you'd be safe doing that. I, I, keep, I, I don't keep mine up. So we did a grilled cheese sandwich. Well, it's in a here. grilled ham and cheese. Oh, even better. And you don't have to do any butter, but full disclosure, for a little bit of flavor, you could do olive oil or a tad sure. bit of butter, but you don't need to. It will still crisp up your bread like a toaster yeah. does. But you can see now how crispy, how perfectly cooked, how ooey gooey and melty everything is. Wow. And now that's that grilled ham and cheese. But I want to put in my traditional grilled cheese, right? Because now you don't actually have to get out a fry pan right. to do a traditional grilled cheese. So there's my traditional grilled cheese. And by the way, this is an entire food group in my house. Yeah, I know. Grilled cheese and mac and cheese yeah. is all the three-year-old eats. Have, I was going to say, you have a child under 10. Yep. So uh, you've got kids or grandkids. They that's sure. what they eat. They eat the grilled cheese and the mac and yeah. cheese. By the way, you can do mac and cheese in this, and I'll show you mac and so cheese. So you didn't have to do anything complicated there. You just literally no fry you put, pan, a you put a little butter little on the butter. outside. And you just shove I it I will in there. go and flip it, if I, you know, if you want to have that yeah. crunchy on both sides. I will go ahead and come back through and flip it. Sure. By the way, you're getting a recipe book. It comes with more than a dozen full color, really cool dash recipes. Now, what's different about dash recipes is they taste like they're not healthy, but they're healthy. For example, Guy has been oogling and ogling yeah. over the avocado fries. Now, recall Dash's motto is unprocess your food, right? right. They want to give you the tools that you need to get the junk out of your food. In this case, it would be deep fried. Sure. Right? The oils. Yeah. So while we still love the crispy, the crunchy of food, we don't have to fry with Ooh. oils. Now, if you know anybody that doesn't care for vegetables, crisp them up yeah. and it rocks your world. Do you have beets in there too? We or have little onions? Um, little onions, okay. little red tomatoes, carrots. We have asparagus. So this is just your traditional way, roasted veg. This. Look how crunchy. These, when you roast cauliflower like this, it gets a little caramelized and look a little at this brown. One. Oh, how perfect and crispy and crunchy yeah, you see that crazy. little caramelization it's nutty is what it is it, it's delicious mm. it's it's quite amazing and then you can serve these over you know noodles or pasta or on a salad or just yeah. with a dip you know whatever you want to serve it with now you have the ability and look at how much food that served i yeah. mean it's not a teeny tiny little thing no it's two um, to three cups yeah, of food inside it's two to three there, cups yeah. of food uh 1.7 liters but it's really great for you know that single person or that right. couple that just want to like you said you like and my Danny. mom and john my mom or your mom, my mom yep. is never going to own a deep fryer at 85 years old she i wouldn't want her to right um but this she could easily just she could stay you know what and they my mom and john live on a lot of pre-prepared meals like yep. they go to the corner there's a little a market down the thumb that has pot pies oh, their chicken perfect. pot pies would fit perfect would be, and they would there. crisp up that yeah, pot yeah, yeah. pie and that's the thing about air frying that a lot of people really love the concept right of crisping up your food that but better no, be done by the end of the it will show because i want to taste it it'll be done it'll be done yeah. i promise but what most people don't love is getting out the deep fryer dunking everything in a big vat of oil it's all the health you know the things of eating oil it yeah, tastes you store the oil where are you gonna put the oil and also every time I eat fried food I feel guilty unless I'm like at a fair then I have no guilt but every time I have fried food even at a restaurant I'm like oh I feel heavy I feel guilty sure. I feel bloated it doesn't make me feel good when I air fry my food I feel amazing because yeah. I still get that beautiful crisp that tender here's what's happening on the inside of the machine it's like a very high-powered convection system right. it's actually taking that superheated supercharged air and circulating it around your food ever so much that it's like kissing every little morsel, right? Crisping up and crunching it up mm. um, so that you are getting the crisp and the crunch of a fried food, but you are not getting the, uh, you know, the, the, um, the trauma, let's say, of a deep fried right. situation. So all you have to do is put your food on the inside, you hit set time and temp, and you walk away. And it, it's really quite easy. Even something like this little mini pizza or yeah. the little pockets, the little sure. burritos, everything can be air fried. Okay. You know what else? It's really great out and I've noticed is reheating leftovers so even if you have like a yep. if you want to put a, a, a you know a, a oven safe um, bowl inside there like if you have fried rice or things like that it cooks them perfectly and look at those wings you just did crispy what? crunchy as if you were you know at that wing bar ordering a, a, a beer and having your chicken wings but they're Man. deep frying theirs and we are air frying ours and notice there's a little there's a tray inside so they don't rest in the oil no, so that's you, right and i'll show them that out with your tongs and then save the uh, you know say hey listen do what you want with the oil um you know a lot of people 
people save stuff and they use it yeah, down the road. Life, if you yeah. want to use chicken fat, you know, the, the, you can use that for other things as well. So think about things like stir fries. You know, here if you think stir fry from a um, from an Asian restaurant is healthy, I will tell you you're oh. probably wrong. Well, mostly Any, the sodium, right? Anybody that's had rice or they, it's all fried. Yep. And they don't use a teaspoon of oil. They use about a third of a cup of oil wow. every time they do a stir fry. Well, is that fry. why it tastes so good? That's why. It's because <laughs> it's, it's all one of the, the oil. It's, yeah, because it's your your mouth is just tasting oil and butter. It's not healthy. But you don't need that much. Right. You don't. You, you you appreciate it when it's all on there because you just think it tastes so good. But when it's not there and it's cooked properly, it still tastes amazing. In fact, the the all the the everything that's in there tastes even better because you're actually tasting the food. We are getting extremely busy right now. Uh, this is the best price, in my, to my knowledge, we've ever done. You've never had it at $49.95. Uh, I don't believe so. Don't it, so you either. know what, it launched one time and it sold out so yeah. fast. Um, we had like a batch of them come in, they were gone. Yeah. People love this machine. A couple of reasons why, the price point. I mean, typically, you know, a year ago, maybe two years ago, yeah. if you were gonna invest in an air fryer, it'd be $200, $300. It was expensive, it was, yeah. And it still is, yeah. and we sell two $300 air fryers here, and don't get me wrong, great but if you right. are just testing the waters or you're a small well, that family be, that could be more than you need my yeah. mom and john would not need one of our big $200 giant air, fryers. air fryers they don't need it they don't they don't eat that much food and they, and they don't have kids and you know kids are incredibly in love with the crispy fried flavor um <coughs> they'll eat the stuff every day so yep. that's why it really pays off hey can i walk over should i show them the colors the colors there? too go yeah. show them the colors guy because honest to goodness, I have never seen air fryers in such a variety of colors. These are gonna look beautiful on your countertop. All right, so um, my producer Kyle says if you want teal, a teal, if you want this mint green, aqua, I, I finally got there. <laughs> if you want this color, uh, it's very limited, so you can go for that. Um, we have it in black, I have it in red, it comes in white, and then it comes in blue. Um, when you look inside, you'll see there's actually a tray inside that pops out right here. So this is what elevates the food and keeps it off the bottom. So if you get fat and grease, it drips down to the bottom. If you just want to do things like a pudding or whatever inside there or a cheesecake, you could do it right inside here without this. Um, it just, um, it, it's nonstick on the inside. I might spray it the first time just so uh, you can sort of season a little bit. Um, but anyway, that's all you do. That fits in the front. Dash also gives you this great book. And Kelly was showing it, uh, me it earlier, and uh, things like those, uh, that fried avocado slices, French fries, onion rings, wings, chicken, all that stuff. It gives you, oh, wontons, which you can make yourself. Or don't forget, listen, if you're in a pinch, go buy the dang things in the frozen food section, but stick them in your fryer uh, when you want to have a snack. Cause exactly. Not, sometimes you don't want need hors d'oeuvres for 35 people. You well, need them for two or four people. So I am a member of one of those big box stores, and they yeah. sell the most amazing frozen mini crab cake bites. What? And it's real crab, and it's delicious. It's and yummy. so I can do 10 of those, and they're little, don't get yeah. me wrong. And I put them on a salad, and they're done in like three minutes. Kelly, and they're even, crunchy. Even fried shrimp in a bag oh, is yes. pretty good. In I an mean, air it, fryer. You know, if you get it from a reputable company, don't buy like, you know, Joe's fried shrimp, unless it's, you know, like Joe's stone crab. Right. Oh, but, you know, make you sure you buy it. Yeah. And then, I'm telling you, it'll be delicious. Yeah. Because all that stuff is usually fresh frozen and then cooked. And then it's fresh, even fresh frozen uh, right after. So yeah. it, oh, it stays real good. What okay, is so that? this is what I was going to show you. So there's you, your mac and cheese bake. You didn't bake. tell me about that. I, I, well, I was keeping it as a secret. But let me show you how we did it. So on our basket, you're getting the both lids. So when you get it home, you're going to see this top part and then the bottom basket. This is for baking, which is amazing because traditional air fryers, you have to purchase this. Yeah. Did you I'm have something listening. to say? No, no, no I was no. going to let you talk. No, I'm just listening to you. Oh, okay. Go ahead. <laughs> Felt like you had something to jump in on. No, I was going to say something that I held back. Okay. I was because I think you hit it already. There you go. So anyway, so, go. Yeah. So anyways, then if you want to do the crunchy crispy with the with the airflow underneath, then you want to add that into the bottom. But it's removable, so we're not asking you to buy a separate baking basket, yeah. right? Ours comes all together. Are you gonna let me serve but that this mac is, and cheese? This is the mac and cheese bake. This is my favorite part. Is all the crunchy at the top? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me some of that. And then look underneath, though. It's perfectly yeah, ooey it's gooey and melty. So you can even do things like mac and cheese and. I'll tell you, if you have the little circle frozen meals, you could even do the little frozen meals on the inside. As anything that'll fit, you could do inside an air fryer. And what's great about it is it doesn't heat up your entire kitchen. I know yeah. you're getting very impatient you're with me. me more than I can eat, so I well, well, hold on, let's try this. I'm gonna go for that crispy, crunchy But your whole kitchen, when you turn the on the oven, and as it's heating up across the country, mm. we hate to use our ovens, right? Because it heats up the kitchen, you turn down the air conditioning, everybody's sweating, yeah. or hot, you know, at least the cook is. Right. You don't have to do that. I mean, we've got 
maybe a dozen machines going, 10 machines, you barely feel, you know, the heat that's, it's all on the inside. What's happening on the inside of this machine here is it's actually super high power convection. So you can see that fan is taking that superheated air and it's spinning it around our food, which crisps up every little morsel. We're right. It's giving the food a hug, right? So it's like crunching it and crisping it and all those arrows is that superheated air. And that's where you get the crunch, the crunch and the crisp. So you Yum. still have the texture of the fried sure. because I'll be honest with you, I like fried food. I like it for the crunch. I like it for the crisp. The it's the texture. Part. It's something in my you're brain. Right. When you get you're that right. crunch, it tastes better. And that's yeah. what you're still getting. You're just getting it sans oil. No oil if you don't want to add oil. If you want to add oil, be my guest. It's not that you can't you add could oil. Spray some of you could the give it a little spritz, or if you own the Simply Beyond yeah. herbs, the little spray herbs work great in here. You know what's amazing is if you use a machine like this, you'd be shocked at the amount of fat that you save in a year's time. If you could put it in a container, I'm telling you, it'd be like a gallon of, of freaking oil True that you're story. not taking in. Because most prepared food is cooked in oil. You don't need to add more oil to it. And when you put it in a machine like this, even if it's french fries or fried shrimp or something like that, yeah. or even um, okra, whatever it is, oh, fried you'll, okra. you'll watch the oil that was, it was cooked in. It goes down to the bottom. down to the bottom. So it makes it great. You know, that's, I, I listen, I'm, really... I'm not one of those people that's going to tell you there's healthy frying out there. But if there was, this, this is what is the way be, it is. Because right? you can see this is that? perforated. Oh, we just did a little egg omelet. So there's a little omelet there. Um, but that's what Guy's talking about. So it's perforated. Um, and then the oil sinks down to the what? bottom. So look at how cheesy, how look ooey, how, how gooey. beautiful that is. There's a little wow. potato, a little sausage on the inside Yum. there. Um, it's a great machine. I've actually talked to folks that gave us a call here um, at HSN that say they bring it to the office because of the nice footprint. That's a really good idea. I mean, you. so you can take sure. this to the office with you. I mean, you can see the size of it. I would say if you've got one of those small coffee makers, it's probably, what you'd say, that's about the size of a small coffee yeah, maker? Pretty yeah, pretty much. I mean, and it's pretty. I mean, depending on what color you get, it could really make a big statement in your kitchen. Yep. And remember, you have the heat element inside, and then you have the air which circulates around the food. Mm -hmm. So ideal, like a uh, perfect example right here, you know, making meatballs is a pain, but buying them in a bag is easy. Yep. Um, but then you wonder how to cook them. Nope. Um, I could put them in a giant oven, and I could waste a lot of energy, and it would take forever, or I could just pop them in here. Look and, how many and meatballs have a lot I made. I mean, yeah, you got like what it was about ten meatballs. Yeah, nine, three, four, five, six, nine. seven, eight, nine very large meatballs. We just <laughs> plated over a bed, a bed of zucchini noodles and some marinara and a little bit of Parmesan cheese, and that is an incredibly healthy meal. The zucchini is full of vitamins and proteins. Um, you've got your protein in the meatballs, and you could do turkey meatballs or you could do fresh homemade meatballs. Yep. My husband puts a little mozzarella cheese on the inside of his meatball, so when you bite into it, you get that beautiful melted cheese totally your call you don't have to subscribe to any special recipes we do have an air frying cookbook and also you're getting a cookbook that comes included with our air fryer that has more than a dozen dash recipes and if you know and love dash as much as i do um, you know that they're healthy they're different and they're unique and um, if you know guy as much as i do he's totally jumped the shark and he's totally in a different portion of the demo than i am but you know we're why? gonna go with it uh, here, I, can i bring it over to you <laughs> yes you may so i I, I refuse to let the grilled cheese burn, and you know it doesn't take very no, long. It's not burn. I no, like it's not burnt. I like it like perfect. that. Yeah. But I wanted to show everybody the grilled cheese. Look how perfect. All right, and you crunchy. ready? Can you see the ooey gooey? That's that's the grilled cheese that we just made. What? And no frying pan, right? Very little butter. Shannon, look, grilled cheese. Come here, yeah. Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> she's, she also she seems annoyed by you this morning. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, you know what I want? That's a grilled that cheese. looks amazing. You know what I want, though? I'm not oh. going to eat your grilled cheese. Oh. I wanted those the avocado fries. Oh, the, oh, did we? Oh, we got to go yes. get to Well, Can I wanted to get to my pork. Oh. No, this we, is like a pork chop and we, Brussels. We already ate those. You yeah. did. We yeah, did. Gone. We, we ate them very quickly. No, and very Wait, silently. Roasted so, Brussels roasted sprouts. Roasted Brussels sprouts, a That's beautiful pork chop. So oh, amazing. talk yeah. about a gorgeous meal for one. If you've got the, mm. do you ever have the house to yourself? Never. Okay, nor do I. But no. if you did, if say you're out that there and you like have that that sounds like kind of amazing. Yeah. If you have the house to yourself, how about mm. pour yourself a beautiful glass of wine, make yourself a beautiful seasoned pork chop and some Brussels sprouts in your air fryer. Mm. And then all you have to do is clean up that basket how are they looking? Where'd you go? Oh, crazy. Are they? We they're might have left them one. Awesome. Oh, there we go. No, oh, all right. That so, the, crispy? so here, crispy, we, you want crunchy. Some of the dippy stuff yeah, yeah. and then like with a little ranch dip or a little blue cheese Ooh, dip. They're like hot and crispy. So I'm not sure that what that is, is but it looks like some type of a dip. It is you a dip. Know what, it's a though? ranch. Yeah. It's not hot over here. No. Because like, you is, don't get the, the heat. The room is not heated up like it is when you heat up your entire oven. Exactly. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Look at those. 
Uh, yeah. It was too hot. How do you I love that our hot? I love that our, our director says you guys are eating it instead of showing it to Sorry. everybody. Please hold this. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So okay, how much desserts. oil did you have to add? I've got dessert. Not you don't have to add any oil if you don't want, but you can add oil for flavors. Like I like a good avocado oil, or I like the spray on herbs, the Simply Beyond oils <laughs> so good. Um, that we sell here at HSN. You give everything a little spritz with those. But check this out, a peach cobbler. And we use the baking dish. So we removed that air frying tray and we use the baking dish. So imagine the peach cobbler oh over some vanilla ice cream. Um, guys, the sky's the limit with air frying, and now you don't have to break the bank, Shannon. I mean, as you know. If we sold, you know, every appliance, that, every kitchen appliance that you buy, you can't spend $100 or $200 on it. It just gets expensive. Well, I was actually over there and I was like, how is this $49? Like, it's because it's, it's this beautiful size and it's dash. It's you know, compact. Dash. Awesome. This is, uh, that one has to be going quickly, right? The mint, is this one called is the mint? mint? Yeah. Aqua. I like That's the one it. guy wants. It looks has, like a, has a special request yeah, in. Cool, it looks like it? a very special jewelry box. That's that, what I yeah. said. I said, guys, in touch with yeah. that uh, jewelry brand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Well, this anyway. Would be a great Mother's Day gift. Yeah, great it's Mother's like, Day. Oh, Father's Day, even. Yeah, Father's Day gift. Fast. You know what it is? It's a really viable option for people that don't have a lot of money but want to try air frying. Yeah. Because, and that's what Dash put together for us. It's $20 off today. It's a customer pick. The, uh, um, and it's, by the way, this this Dash and everything we have is all part of our spring home event which, by the way, uh, is coming up very soon. Hey, listen, you can enjoy it right now at hsn.com. You can grab all kinds of great stuff uh, that you need to do your home. By the way, Kelly Diedrich, thank you so much. That was amazing. Did you try one of those avocado things? It was one in my mouth. Oh, right my now. Lord. Anyway, uh, we got all kinds of great stuff over there at hsn.com. So if you're looking to get your uh, outdoor patio prepared, uh, we got great stuff. By the way, I'm coming back at 9 o'clock with an hour of at home, which will be out on the garden patio, so we're going to enjoy that as well. All right, it's uh, Customer Appreciation Month as well, so you get extra flex on your HSN card, so we wanna add that too. Um, and I know, I see Shannon over there. Did you, Shannon, I think, finally finished her avocado, and now she's hanging out. Do I have avocado in my teeth, yeah, avocado she fries? Did, totally. Okay. Now you're good. Well, we've got a great set for you, and of course, the name in kitchen and cutting, Cuisinart, we've got for the first time that I've ever presented this, 12 pieces of the most incredible ceramic coated knives ever. We are introducing a brand new bread knife for you into this set. Do, please don't let the price fool you because $24.95, these are very powerful professional knives. They come with the sheaves and that's because they're so sharp. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> yeah, that's like the drum roll right there. There's Mark Gill. Very here. nice. That's our drum roll. roll. That's our drum roll. We have I the, love that. The, the cucumber cutting, please. <laughs> that's um, the best. These are so incredibly sharp. They're also beautiful. $24.95 right. you're saving. 50% today. You're getting six amazing ceramic coated knives and you were explaining to me how that's so important, but they're usually really expensive. Well, here's the thing, you guys. First of all, remember, 100% ceramic knives are tough to sharp, very expensive, and a little tough to work with. So as we get into the features and benefits of these knives, and believe me, I've been playing with knives for 25 years. I know exactly what I'm looking for in a set of knives, whether it's a buck or a thousand bucks, really doesn't matter. And these guys have checked off everything on the list. So let me walk you through these knives and show you why almost 300,000 people oh my gosh. have picked these up, okay? So let's walk through it, all right? First things first that you're going to notice about this, other than the name Cuisinart, let's be real here, is you've got a knife that's sharpened on both sides. Now, what's the big deal? If you've ever tried to cut into a vegetable and it's shot off one direction or the other, you know what I'm talking about. So let me tell you, I can't explain how much I appreciate the control yeah. of these knives in my kitchen. And guys, you are seeing this. This is live. I'm making contact lenses out of grapes. <laughs> that's the kind of edge we're talking about. You can read through that, guys. That's the big deal right there. Now, we talk about the coating. All right. Yep. What we've done is we've coated our stainless steel knives at its heart. These are stainless steel. They look, feel, and act like a, uh, a professional stainless steel chef's mm -hmm. knife. But that coating, that beautiful color, is ceramic. Now, ceramic is what they use on the outside of the space shuttle to get our boys and girls back home safe. So believe me, if it's good enough for the space shuttle, it's going to be good enough for your carrot. I promise you, okay? <laughs> now, as far as durability, these are scratch resistant. They're stain resistant. They're not going to, you know, get wrecked in the drawer, the dishwasher. They're never, ever going to, you know, going to discolor on you and these knives 
even have a French tip. That's huge to me. That's the same angle that your wrist attaches to your hand with. You ever heard that a knife is supposed to be an extension of your hand? That's so that when you're doing close work, you have the control that you need because the two most important things in any kitchen are clean hands and a good knife. And I gotta tell you something, you guys. Today is not your choice of. This is your eight inch chef's knife. And here's the cool thing, you guys. We are only on knife Number one. Are you kidding with that? <laughs> and you're getting sick. <laughs> I love it. Also, when you talk about quality, a lifetime limited warranty on these knives. This could be the last set you will ever buy for yourself or for mom or for dad as well. Um, Mother's Day, Father's Day. You're getting the eight inch chef's knife. They all come with the blade guards, by the way. The eight inch slicing knife, the eight inch bread knife, that one's new to the set. Seven inch Santoku knife, six and a half inch utility knife, three and a half inch paring knife. And there it is, the manufacturer's lifetime limited warranty. Oh boy. All for $24.95, it's $8.32 to get it home and a sharp knife is a safe knife absolutely right? a sharp knife is always a safe knife because it's going to go where you expect it to go if yes. the knife's dull you give it more pressure oops right so guys if you'll notice all of these come with sheaths say that slowly or you say it wrong uh -huh. sheaths all right <laughs> now this is usually the point of our presentation where i try and sell you a knife block but you don't need it for this one because we've included the protection for the knives and the drawers and your fingers all at once now this is our santoku knife and if you've ever thought to yourself hold on there big fella Santoku knives have little divots in the metal down the side. Well, the reason those are there is so that the food doesn't stick. Well, guys, this is ceramic. Food doesn't stick to ceramic. We don't <laughs> need to take those off the side. That means that we maintain the weight, so now you don't have to buy a cleaver. So if you ever get the urge to hack up a pineapple like that, you got the knife to do it. Wow. So let me go ahead and put this to the side and really show you something kind of cool, okay? Because it's one thing to hack up that pineapple. All right, I'm gonna wipe my hands off here because pineapple's pretty slippy. Uh, <laughs> it's one thing to hack up a pineapple. It's another thing for that real world stuff, all right? Guys, we've all all done this in the kitchen and you might as well just hit it with the back of the knife for as much as this cuts through right. it. Watch this. Guys, Cuisinart since 1972 has been doing nothing but giving you the top quality products all over the house. How they've done this set for this kind of money is so beyond me I can't even deal with it. And if you want to talk control, watch this tomato you guys. I'm telling you, this is one of my favorite demos. I call this my Andy demo. Andy's my father-in-law, all right? Because the very first time I did this, he looked at it and said, hold on there. What's happening? Are you actually doing that live? Hold on. And he kept saying, well, What's the deal, man? What's holding that tomato down there? It's nothing. It's the ceramic for the non-stick. It's the blade for that control. And look at that, Andy. Nothing's holding that to the board, I tell you. Wow. <laughs> Isn't and that the best? Because it's that amazing knife and also the balance. I know, and I'm not a chef. I don't can't claim to be a chef. I, you know, was a the horrible waitress. That's as close as I got to a restaurant. <laughs> wow. Um, Sounds like quite a recipe. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I do love to eat in restaurants. <laughs> but I do know that the weight makes a big difference. Because I do cook for my family. And and that, you know, most of us aren't going to be professional chefs, but we're going to cook for our family. It's the it's the weight and the sharpness and the balance of a knife that exactly. really makes it effective. Well, exactly. Because, again, it's all about that control in your hand. So whether you've got the herbs with the herb curve on mm. this blade, so you don't need a bezel and a knife, whether you You've got the tomato that acted like it wasn't even there right. or if you're doing the stickiest mozzarella you're not having to peel it off the knife every time it just kind of falls away so guys these knives when i first got them i gotta tell you when i see a price like that on a set of knives when it comes across my desk i'm not all that motivated yeah. but then i saw cuisinart and then i saw limited lifetime guarantee and i started to get excited i'm like okay this might be cool for that spare set that extra set something in a camper or you know something to keep at the office but here's what i discovered this is not your spare set of knives this is not your extra please join almost 300,000 people so far that, is, that have made this their main set because that's what it is this is your go-to set don't let that price fool you guys 25 years like i said playing with the scissors running with knives all that kind of stuff or vice versa I know what to look for in a set of knives, and this has it all. It does, and you're getting all six. They come with the sheaths and a manufacturer's lifetime limited warranty. So you get the eight inch chef's knife and the, with the blade guard, the eight inch slicing knife, the eight inch bread knife, the seven inch Santoku knife, the six and a half inch utility knife, the three and a half inch paring knife. Guy, we're only on number three knife, right? even demonstrating, and they all come with a manufacturer's lifetime limited warranty. It's $8.32 to get it home. They're color coordinated, so the sheath goes with the knife you're never having to wonder which goes with which or where did I find my where did I put my 
each one of these will become your go-to knife. We all have those knives yeah, in our absolutely. block that we're like, that's the only one I really use anyway. I don't know why I have an entire block built. Yeah, right? <laughs> exactly. Um, and these are, I'm gonna make up a new word, sharpenable. Exactly, right? well listen, when you go and buy all ceramic knives, you can't sharpen those. Well, you can, but it's like 200 bucks, right? Stainless steel knives are great because you can sharpen them. Well, how about the best of both worlds? And that's what Cuisinart's given to you. And that's why they feel confident with the limited lifetime guarantee. When's the last time you saw that on these things? Now, guys, right. here's something kind of cool. And this is the demo where I say, you know what? Do me a favor. Wake the neighbors. Grab anybody that you know camps, hunts, fishes, because I don't want me to tell you what a great knife I'm about to show you is. I want them to do it because those guys have spent two, three, four hundred bucks on knives that are do, that'll do exactly what you're about to see. So, guys, watch this, okay? This is so cool. First thing I'm going to do with this salmon is I'm just going to go ahead and slice her down the middle. Now, no big deal, right? But here's the part that some people miss. There was skin on there, you guys. How often do you fight with the skin on a salmon? And I like to say, but I'm not stopping there. Well, I'm not. So, guys, watching this, this is where it gets real. Watch this. This is every feature of that knife. This is the non-stick. This is the incredible blade. This is the resistance to odors, stains. This is the ease of use, guys. That is a job that usually takes wow. a knife worth hundreds of dollars. I'm gonna do it one more time because this is one of those ones where people are like, hold on, did I just see that? Yeah, come to your TV <laughs> if you missed that one. You've gotta come and watch this before your very eyes. Look at that. That's the real deal, you guys. If you can't hunt fish, know anybody that does, that's the real deal. Don't let me tell you, let them tell you. There's a reason 300,000 of these have gone flying out the door in the last year, year and a half. Guys, grab yours, they're incredible. You're gonna love them. Wow, and if it does that with your salmon, imagine your steaks, your right? chicken, anything that you've got that might be tough, your pineapple, I mean, these are knives there is not a job in your kitchen that these six knives can't tackle with beauty. Of course, because they're so adorable. Each one of them has their own color. But also, you aren't gonna have to worry about babying these knives. Right. You're literally gonna stick the sheath on, you're gonna throw them in the drawer, but you're gonna pull them out all the time. Look at that. Sushi. Save yourself right a couple there. bucks. Uh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> sushi knife. Holy cow, right? Now, here's, guys, this is pretty cool. You know, it's one thing to get a set of knives at a reasonable price with some good features and benefits, some usability. But when you start throwing in specialty knives, that's when you go, what's going on? Guys, watch this, all right? If you ever walk into one of those fancy dancy uh, kitchen stores at the mall, you know what I'm talking about. You're gonna walk over to your specialty knife section and the price of those knives go through the roof. Oh yeah. Because they're small production specific jaws. Well guys, I want you to have this knife because I'll tell you, here's one of my favorite uses for it. Nice and wide, right? And this blade, I'm gonna show you here why in a second, is only sharpened on one side and there's a reason for that, okay? Specialty knives have different features than other knives have. So watch. I'm gonna do here, okay? And I remember the first time I talked about this demo, right? We were running, we have to run all of our demonstrations by a team and stuff, and they're like, uh, so you're gonna take time on national TV to put mayonnaise on a sandwich? <laughs> yes, I am. Here's why. Guys, if you're like me and you work hard all week and Saturday comes and you've made that sandwich that you're not allowed to eat and everybody's <laughs> out of the house, the last thing you want my friends, is something that's gonna hack this up. Well, watch this, you guys, I love this so much. Not only is the knife designed to get in there and spread all the condiments to what you have to do, but watch this. And there's a reason your delis have these kind of knives. Watch this. I'm gonna knock this on the cutting board, you guys. Look underneath it, there are no crumbs falling. Uh -huh. Are you kidding me with this? Guys, that is the pretty cut that a specialty knife gives you. That's the reason people spend so much money on those and you're getting one in your set today. That's I, crazy, I, I love, love it. it. And you can spend more than $24.95 <laughs> just on a specialty knife like that. Cool. You know what else Put I noticed? Zero there. That Cuban bread is still nice and soft. It's not squished because you squished <sighs> it down with that knife. This is your chance at $24.95. You've got about three minutes left to get Six of the most incredible knives, honestly. Ceramic coated, a lifetime limited warranty. They come with the sheaths. You get all six. You're not choosing today for $24.95. And it's not a no-name brand. This right. is Cuisinart. This I mean, Cuisinart. there are some there are some products from Cuisinart that I have coveted Tell for years what. and years to have in my kitchen. But this is when you don't have to covet. You can get it. It's $24.95. Whether you're replacing the knives that you have that you spent hundreds of dollars on, or you just want those everyday knives that right. you can use, exactly. these really will be your go-to. And speaking of an everyday knife, a set has to have a paring knife, you sure. guys. And a paring knife is very important because it's the knife that all the close work's done with. So here you go, guys. A paring knife should be the approximate distance from the top of your finger to the tip of your wrist there, just like that, okay? So when you grab onto that, it really is that extension of your hand and your finger. So when you're doing that close work, when you're doing all those little jaws, if you like doing garnishes, if you like mm -hmm. getting right in there, these are the ones to do. But always remember, 
Grandma cuts towards herself with a paring knife. So make sure, especially if it's gift giving time, Mother's Day coming up, get one of those sets of knives that you know is gonna be safe for everybody to use in the kitchen, which I do love. And let's talk one more time about that non-stick of ceramic, okay, you guys? If you've ever tried to shave garlic, you know that every step in between, you gotta stop and peel that shaving off that knife. Well, watch this, you guys. Nothing sticks <laughs> to this knife, I love it. All right, so we've All talked right. about our chef, our Santoku, our slicer, our pairing, something else. <laughs> All right. the One, two, three, four, five. We're on six is exactly. what we are. There we go. We're on six. And this is the bread knife that has not been included if you purchased one of uh, exactly. a Cuisinart set before. This is the new one to the exactly. family right here. Well, this is our brand new one that we're introducing in our set today. Guys, we want you to have a bread knife, all right? We absolutely need you to have one. I want you to see this, okay? This is one of those bread knives that are sharpened and designed to give you such control and such precision that you can take a soft French loaf bread and cut a slice like that without it ripping and tearing. And here's why. Remember when I said they take the time and care to sharpen both sides of the blades on our sets of knives? Sure. Well, watch this. Guys, it's not like this just runs through the same little boat in the factory. This knife is only sharpened on one side. Why is that important? Because with bread, you wanna be able to cut through that thick slice as evenly and quickly as possible. So when you sharpen just one side, you take a razor blade and make it even more of a razor, you guys. That is the clean type of cut you're gonna get. You'll love it. I so love that's it. our bread knife, our paring knife, our sandwich specialty knife, our slicing knife, <laughs> our santoku knife, and let's finish where we started, you guys. There it is. Your workhorse, your everyday. Listen. The cucumber drum roll. Lifetime guarantee, you guys. This is the real deal. I want you to have these knives like 300,000 other people and enjoy. That's a lot of cucumbers you can cut in a I lifetime. I'll tell you what. Right? A lifetime <laughs> I love it. $8.32 for you to get at home. Remember, you're getting all six and a lifetime warranty on that with the name that we know and love and trust, Cuisinart. Thank you so much, Thank Mark. Thank you very Mark much. Mark another name that we know and trust <laughs> um, and love, of course. Oh! That's a butternut squash. Tell you, you rob a bank with one of these. Those have been my <laughs> nemeses. So, but yep. This is, makes it very easy work of that. All right, well, don't go anywhere because we've got our incredible today special for you right now.